that I like to do all the time. I think my relationship with Vossen works being that there's so many people in the car industry, but us two together create such passion and love for what we do and being able to spread it through the creativity of cars. I'm James McDonald and this is my BMW i8. What I think separates my i8 from everybody else's is obviously the first thing is going to be air suspension because I still, two years later, after being bagged, have yet to see another i8 on air suspension. The other thing that I think separates my i8 from others is the fact that I'm constantly changing it up to the point that I've now had three different wraps and about six or seven different sets of wheels on it and all the other ones that I've seen have been modded but stay at a standstill. The Port of Miami shoot, being that I've already done four or five shoots with Boston and several others with other companies, um, I can honestly say to this day was my favorite shoot. Just the vibes and the experience of being at the Port of Miami and knowing that it's a very special situation that you get to shoot in there it was amazing. And to be alongside another i8 that was lowered on wheels from Lula V was more incredible. Honestly, when Jav sent me a picture of a lot of the LC designs, I really liked it because, especially when I saw them at SEMA, because it brings some of the signature designs of a three-piece wheel, like having a chunk lip, and it brings it to a one-piece face. And I've had two sets of them now, and both sets I've really loved. So other than the i8, uh, I enjoy all types of automobiles. I have a BMW X5M that I really love because I have a loud exhaust on it and it allows me to make some noise that I'm not able to make in the i8 being that it's a hybrid. Uh, when I'm not driving either of those, I'm either riding on my Harley Davidson 48 Sportster. It's a 1200cc and as well my Honda Grom which I've found to become my daily being that it has a one gallon tank and gets 100 miles out of that tank. Can't complain about that. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to message her back and say, Snapchat, Lord McDonald. This <laughs> Let me put it right there. Hold on, let her focus. Send, send all the nudes to Snapchat, Lord McDonald. After the photo shoot with the Lula V i8 at the Port of Miami, which to date is probably my favorite photo shoot I've ever done, slash video shoot. And after that, I quickly got together with Danny from Slammered Inc. and HP Drive Tech out of Austria and told them that I really had a vision that I wanted to put together the first bagged i8 in the world. And within three months, we accomplished that goal. A couple months later, we made it into SEMA 2015, where I really got to put the car on showcase for the rest of the world to see. Got in magazines after that. And once you're on air suspension, you feel the ultimate freedom of being able to look as low as possible when you're parked and have complete functionality when you're driving. So now we're gonna head off to Mr. Smokes and get some rollers on the way there. We're at Mr. Smoke's gallery. Let's go inside and check out some glass. So growing up having a love for all art forms, when I'm not seen doing something surrounding cars, I'm either at my gallery, Mr. Smoke's, or doing something else that involves glass. No matter 
what you can afford and what you can have to enjoy what you have to the fullest and have full passion with that because you have to remember you're modding your car for yourself and for what you love to do and how you like to spread your creativity and not to show it off. So just my advice is to keep your passion, stay, have fun with your passion and just do it for your love.